hey guys and welcome back to my channel or welcome if you are new thank you all so much for clicking on this video so today i headed into walmart and i did do a, a like a earlier walmart haul but my computer has been acting up where it wasn't letting me edit my videos or like anything like that um so i couldn't like i couldn't put it together so i couldn't put it up but i finally fixed it like yesterday so i was able to get my cvs video up but I decided not to show the first video just because I knew I was going to go out to Walmart today again to do a new haul. And some of the deals that were in that previous video, all the um, rebates expired already. So I just decided not to do it. But here I am today and I will be working on a weekend warrior bonus of 15 offers for $5. So let's go inside and see what we can get. So the first deal is going to be on the Alka-Seltzer Kids. It is $3.79. I'm going to use this dollar off coupon from the Alka-Seltzer website. So I'll be left to pay just $2.79 at the register. But Ibotta has a $2 rebate for this product, making the final cost just $0.79. Cents. Next, I'm going to do the Poise or a Poise deal. I was going to pick up the regular kind of Poise because they were cheaper, but... The coupon is not for that product, so it's only on these. So I'm going to pick up this one by Poise liners at $5.46. I'm going to use this $3 for one coupon from the 2-6 Smart Source. I'll be left to pay just $2 with 46 cents at the register. And then on Ibotta, there's a $2 rebate for this product, making the final cost just 46 cents. Then I'll be picking up two of these U by Kotex Light Days Plus liners. You can also pick up these Barely There liners, but I'm going to go with this one. They're $2.97 each. Two of them will give me $5.94. I'm going to use this $4 off a of 2 coupon from our 1-2 Smart Source. I'll be left to pay just $1.94 in store. And then Ibotta has a dollar rebate for this product with a limit of 5, so I'll get that twice. Making the final cost for both of these free and a six cent money maker. The next few deals are gonna be on some Irish Spring. The first one is on this Irish Spring Premium. They are four dollars with ninety seven cents. I'm gonna pick up one of them. I'm gonna use this dollar for one manufacturing coupon from our two twenty smart source. I'll be left to pay just $3.97 in store, and then Ibotta has a $2 rebate, making the final cost just $1.97. Next deal is on the regular Irish Spring Body Wash. They have changed the packaging, but it's like the normal one, I assume. It's $4.97. I'm going to pick up one of them. I'm going to use another dollar off of one manufacturing coupon from the 220 Smart Source. So I'll pay just $3.97 in store for this, but Ibotta has a separate $2 rebate for this product, making the final cost just $1.97. And last Irish Spring deal is on the Irish Spring 8 count bar soaps. They are $4.97. I'm going to use this $1 off coupon from the 220 Smart Source. I'll be left to pay just $3.97, but then Ibotta has another separate rebate for $2 back on this item, making the final cost just $1.97. So I know it's a lot of Irish Spring deals, but I have a customer that's constantly asking me for Irish Spring, so I'm trying to pick some up for him. Next, I'm going to be picking up two of these Colgate Kids Cavity Protection Toothpaste at $0.94. Cents. Two of them with me a dollar 88 i'll pay that in store and then on the coupons.com app these are attaching to a coupon for three dollars back when you buy two so i'll submit for that making both of these free and a dollar 12 cent money maker this next deal i'm not gonna do but i thought was a good deal to share it's on the colgate hum smart rhythm um it is 24 dollars 97 cents You'd pay that in store. On Ibotta, there's a ten dollar rebate for this product, and then on Swagbucks, there's a rebate for seven hundred points back when you buy it, which is seven dollars, which will make your final cost just seven dollars and ninety seven cents. 
which like I said I felt like was a pretty good deal for something that's normally 20 almost $25 um, I'm just gonna skip on it for now I think I'll wait to see if the swag swag bucks rebate goes higher or wait till I reach or I'm closer to my $15 bonus so next I came to the clearance section at this store and they did have quite a bit um, just nothing that would benefit me in any way. So, but what they did have was the Sayate tortilla chips. They are on clearance at this store for just $2. So I'm going to pick up one of them, pay the $2 in store on Ibotta's. There's a dollar rebate for this item, which will make the final cost just a dollar. And these bags are normally like $4.68 or something like that. So yeah, I'm going to pick up one of them. Next, I'm going to be picking up the Eucerin Advanced Repair Cream at $6.97. I'm going to use the $3 for one coupon from our 130 save insert. So I'll pay just $3.97 in store. There's a $3 rebate on Ibotta for this item, which will make my final cost just $0.97. Cents. Then I also will be picking up this Eucerin Advanced Repair leg and foot foam for $6.97 using another $3 off of one manufacturing coupon from the 130 save insert. I'll pay just $3.97 in store. I bought it has a $2 rebate for this item making the final cost just $1.97. Next, I'll be picking up one of these skin to mint shave gels for $3. I'll pay that in store, submit my receipt to the coupons.com app for a dollar back, and then to Ibotta for a dollar rebate, making my final cost just $1. There are coupons on our 220 smart stores and on coupons.com if you already use the coupon on coupons.com, the app. Next, I'll be picking up this Chic Hydro Sensitive Razor. It is $8.97 at my store. I'll pay that in store, then submit my receipt to the coupons.com app for a $4 coupon on there, and then to Ibotta for a $3 rebate. Plus, I'll be hitting a dollar bonus for this item because of the refills that I bought a while ago. So that will make my final cost just $0.97. Cents. Without the bonus, it'll be $1.97. I'll be picking up one of these Bic Flex 3 razors at $3.97. Ibotta has a $3 rebate, making the final cost just $0.97. Cents. Next, I'm going to pick up this all laundry free and clear detergent at $3.47. I'm going to use this $1.50 off coupon from our 220 save insert. I'll be left to pay just $1.97 in store. On Ibotta, I have a $1.50 rebate, making the final cost just $0.47. Cents. Now, I did also want to pick up the blue one, but my store is all completely sold out, so I cannot. But hopefully I can get it next time. Next, I saw this deal on Saving with Shea. It's on these Airwick warmers. It is $3.48. We have a $3.99 coupon on coupons.com. I don't think it's available anymore, so hopefully you got it when it was out. Um, so it's gonna make that coupon's gonna make this item free and give us 51 cents in overage. Um, there is a rebate on Fetch Rewards as well. For when you spend 15 on Airwick items, you will get a bonus of 2,500 points, which is $2.50. I don't have that many coupons on me right now, but once I get them, um, this will be a bigger money maker. So the next couple laundry deals I'm going to show you, I'm not going to do them, but I thought I'd still share. The first one is on the Suave Tail Complete dryer sheets they are two dollars and 97 cents you'll pay that in store ibotta has a dollar rebate which will make your final cost for one of these just a dollar 97. this suavitel complete hypoallergenic uh softener is two dollars with 98 cents it has a dollar rebate on ibotta making the final cost just a dollar 98. Next is on some snuggle dryer sheets. The 40 count is $1.97. We have a $1.50 off coupon in our 220 save insert. You'd use that coupon and it'll make your final cost for this item just 47 cents. 
next it would be on the snuggle dryer sheets the 120 count it is four dollars for 47 cents you'd use that same one dollar and fifty cent off coupon you'll pay just two dollars and 97 cents in store ibotta has a dollar fifty rebate which will make your final cost just a dollar forty seven and lastly it will be on the snuggle 90 load softener at six dollars and 47 cents you would use the same one dollar and fifty cent off coupon on this item pay just four dollars and 97 cents in store ibotta has a two dollar and fifty cent rebate for this item which will make your final cost just two dollars and 47 cents and like I said, I'm not going to do any of these deals just yet. I kind of want to wait for my bigger bonuses to hopefully lower my out-of-pocket on these items. But definitely not a bad deal, especially if you need these items or like these items. I think it all these are great prices. Next deal is going to be on this Maxwell House little coffee containers. They are $2.96. I'm going to pick up two of them to give me $5 with 92 cents. On Ibotta, each of these flavors are attaching to two $1.25 rebates. So I'm going to pick up two of them to give me $5 with 92 cents. Uh, I'll submit my receipt to Ibotta to get a total of $2.50 for each one. So a total of $5. And then on Swagbucks, there's a rebate for 100 points back. When you buy two Maxwell products, which is a dollar, which will make my final cost free and an eight cent money maker for the both of them. Oh, Next deal is an easy rebate deal if you like this stuff or just need a rebate for your bonuses. It's on the French style green beans or this green cut green beans. They are 50 cents. There is a 10 cent any beans rebate that is attaching to both of these items so you pick up one of them at 50 cents pay that in store submit your receipt to ibotta for 10 cents back making the final cost just 40 cents next deal i'm gonna do is on the herdez avocado hot sauce it is two dollars and 78 cents i'm gonna use this dollar hang tag i'll pay just a dollar 78 in store ibotta has a dollar rebate making my final cost just 78 cents deal anyone can do is on the seafood to snackers they are a dollar there's a 50 cent any alaskan food rebate which will make your final cost just 50 cents i'm personally not going to do this because it's not free and i know no one in my house is going to eat it i still have the ones from last time just sitting in my fridge so but if you guys like these or know someone that likes these go ahead and pick them up because it's not a bad deal and an easy rebate to get Next, I am going to pick up one of these Butterfingers. This is the wrong price. They are just, or only 98 cents. I have a 25 cent I bought a rebate, making my final cost just 73 cents. Next deal is a Shopkick rebate. It's on these Turtles dark chocolate pecan candies. They are a dollar. You'd pay that in store. Shopkick has a rebate for a total of 220 points back, which is 88 cents which will make the final cost for this item just 12 cents. If you like this candy and dark chocolate, go ahead and pick it up. If the rebate was for the milk chocolate, I would pick it up, but it's not, so I'm not getting this. And the last deal I have for you guys that I won't be doing, but is a good deal, is on the Love Diapers. They are $5.47. Um, I would pick up two of them. That will equal us $10.94. I wanted to use a $3 off of 2 manufacturing coupon from the March P&G, so I would be left to pay just $7 with 94 cents. I bought it has a $3 rebate for these. Uh, it is a limit of once, so you'll only get that $3 once. <laughs> um, so bring your final cost for two packs, just $4.94 or just $2.47 each, which is a super good deal. Um, like I've been saying for all the other deals, I think I just want to wait till I hit my bigger bonuses. But definitely not a bad deal if you guys are in need of diapers. So if you want it, get it.
right guys this is everything i picked up at my walmart haul today i did work on mine and my mom's account because her treasure chest bonus is like 30 offers for 12 dollars which is super awesome and after picking all this up i think i i only need five more rebates for that so hopefully by the time her next bonus comes in i will i i should complete that but anyways uh, my total for all this before any coupons would have been $128.75. I got, I had a total of $40.48 in coupons. I got a total of $53 back from Ibotta for rebates. I got a total of $11 back on Ibotta for bonuses. And then I did get a couple of gift cards, so I got a total of $0.26 cents back for the gift cards. On Fetch Rewards, I got a total of 352 points, which is around $0.35. Cents. On swag bucks, I got a total of 206 points, which is $2 with 6 cents. And then on the coupons.com app, I got a total of $8 back, giving me a total savings of $115 with 15 cents, making my final cost for everything you see right here to just $13 with 60 cents or around 38 cents per item, which I'm super happy with. Um, like I mentioned earlier, I have a customer that's been asking for Irish Spring. He wiped me out last time, so um, yeah, I'm just trying to get some more for him. I definitely um, definitely would have been lower out of pocket if I would have switched the Irish Spring out for some other items, but the Irish Spring is kind of something I really wanted. Um, I'm super happy with this, but anyways... This is it for me, guys. I did not have any issues on Ibotta. It did not pick up my Herda's uh, avocado hot sauce, so I did have to, like, add that in. But other than that, I didn't have any issues. Everything else went through. And, yeah, on my other rebates app, I had no issues. So this is it for me, guys. This is my whole haul. I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope to help you out with your couponing, putting your deals together, or reaching your bonuses on Ibotta. And if you guys have any more questions, please do not hesitate to ask. I'll always be more than happy to help you guys out in any way that I can. And of course, thank you all so much for clicking on this video and watching what I do. I really appreciate it. And you guys, it truly does mean a lot to me. And I am beyond blessed for you guys for it. And until next time, guys, have a good day. Bye.